Hub Initiative is an organization that is based in San, in San Bernardino. It helps out the larger community in San Bernardino, so um, whoever needs food, whoever needs um, classes just to get through any hardships. The Haba Initiative aims to serve families and individuals through social and mental health services. We're engaged in serving the community through direct services, um, whether it's Muslim or non-Muslim, to provide services that the community needs. We offer a variety of programs ranging from mental health services such as uh, AA meetings, Alcoholic Anonymous, NA meetings, Narcotics Anonymous, um, individual counseling. We triage a lot of our services to get people to the aid that they need. And once you get to know them a little bit better, you start noticing that you know they have a lot of different things they, they need help with. You know, a lot of people don't have the opportunity to um, you know pay rent every month. And a lot of times people you know become Muslim and the first thing they need to do is figure out how they're gonna pay their rent because the way they used to make money wasn't you know was either selling drugs or something like that and it becomes really Difficult to be able to you know, balance being a faithful person, but also leaving, letting go of this past life, lifestyle. We also provide financial services um, for individuals and families that are in need, including zakat services. Someone who came in and needed a little assistance, um, they was coming in for food um, at first. And then there, after we talked a few minutes, they um, expressed some other needs, like for a light bill and they express how they went to other organizations and they couldn't get any help. Uh, Gennaro helped me and it, it made me feel good. When I first came in, he welcomed me and my family through the doors when we first came in. I was short on my electricity money and my, my lights were getting turned off and I have two kids at the house and I had no food and stuff. So that's why the organization said this organization can help me. The, this anecdote has come for the next day. So we was able to get them um, pay the bill for them so their lights can stay on. It helps out great. He helped out a great deal. The whole organization has. We have many programs. Um, this includes the Torchbearers program, and that is more targeted towards the youth. And for that, it's more showing the youth that they can volunteer in activities such as like heat feeding the homeless and giving them hygiene kits. Our Torchbearers program, where we aim to create socially active and socially responsible youth through service, through social services, through creating and training programs that will enable them to sustain a level of service to their local community. So the social we really hold together to bring people together to volunteer to help more people. So a lot of people don't have the opportunity, don't know what way they can get involved. So we host socials to get people involved in our community and um, these socials serve as a bridge to get people involved into serving. So we can do, it does one of two things. It first, um, you know, helps us fundraise and raise money to serve people, and also provides volunteers the bridge to come get you know be a part of Sahab Nation and start helping people in the community. The biggest event that it would be great for people to volunteer at is the food pantry every other Wednesday, which um, allows us to directly help those in need. So every other Wednesday, we'll, anyone can come in through the doors and ask for food, and we'll give them a, a huge bag of food filled with. Um, like canned food, fresh products, meat, anything that they need. The, with the food program every other Wednesday, I try to make sure I show up every other Wednesday. <laughs> so it's been great. It's been beneficial and it helps my family out a lot. They allowed me to work here. They provided me with food and I was welcome and I'm still welcome. And that's what's good about it. So there's a couple ways to get involved in Sahab Initiative. One of them is by you know volunteering your time if you're in the community, coming out to our events, staying updated with our events. I was just looking for uh, Muslim organizations that I could volunteer my time at, and this is the only one I could find in San Bernardino County. So um, it popped up, I came down, and um, it just so happened that I knew uh, Gennaro. And so uh, I've been here volunteering ever since. We're providing a positive Muslim voice in the community. Um, when someone think of Muslim in San Bernardino, they might, inshallah, our hope is to think of the work that Sahaba Initiative is doing to feed the homeless, to uh, help with um, information about mental health, to um, engage the community with services. I mean, this is what I hope. Um, our experiences in San Bernardino is in the Inland Empire as well. 
Our aim is that through these services, we can develop strong, healthy, contributing members of society. I experience strong ties, good ties, um, blending with the family, and growing like a religious community, and sharing with help. That essentially is our goal, is to empower individuals and families that they get to a point that they can actually come back to Sahaba Initiative where they once received help and give other people the same help that they received. There's not a lot of Muslim organizations that you can go to and even volunteer here in San Bernardino. There's, there's almost nothing. Sahaba Initiative really, it has an impact in many ways. One, that, that we do serve and we fill in a lot of the voids that the community has because oftentimes social and particularly mental health services are overlooked. So we aim to fill that void and hopefully we're, we're doing our job. But also it gives individuals an opportunity who they want to help. They, they really want to help, but they might not have the avenue or might not know how to help. So we give people that opportunity to help and to aid their community. I think one of the things that for Sahab Initiative really to grow, what we need is a strong endowment and strong um, admin support. So we need a lot of our staff, we need to hire more staff, we need to hire more people to commit their time, you know, full-time support to these different programs. So we need someone there full-time just for our, our food pantry and to expand and grow that program. And we need people there full-time for our Zakat program, for our, our gardens, for all these different programs. We need people there to commit their, you know, nine to five job or whatever hours they work to focus on developing these programs. So your support will help, you know, hire these people, get people on board and you know, so we can kind of focus and work on the strategic vision of Sahab Initiative. A great way to help Sahab Initiative is by donating. With your donations, it will help Sahab Initiative help the community. Every dollar counts, so please donate now.